All right, what you see here is a new fan I got off of Crowdtwist. This is a Monte Carlo Studio ceiling fan. It's a 54 inch industrial ceiling fan. I say that with quotations around it because in a sense these are more so a residential fan, not so much a industrial fan, but since these do have metal blades, I still consider it an industrial. I just got three of these recently from Craigslist for free. This is the first one out of three. This one's the oldest one out of three of them. The seller, or well, the person that gave them to me, had these for at least a good 18 years. He told me he got them back in late 2003, early 2004, I want to say, or somewhere around then. And he's been using them in name. Um, he had like an upstairs area that was like a, basically he had like a two family home, he's now renting the second floor out, but um, and he's just going to keep the downstairs portion for him to live in, and he removed these due to the fact that the, the, f the first floor has ceilings that are lower than nine feet, and with these having metal blades, they do have to be above ten feet from the, air the ground, the blades, and clearance that is so instead of just throwing them out he figured he'd put them on Craigslist for free so I drove out to pick them up as I've been looking to get some of these for quite some time now and also they are pretty big childhood fans of mine as well as there was a um or there, there's a motorcycle store that has a few of these along with some neutral pro line twos in the the shop area and in office, they did have a Hunter Low Profile 2 in bright brass with a bullet spotlight. That unfortunately is no longer there as they renovated that little office. But the Monte Carlo Studios and the Newtown Pro Line 2s are still there to this day. But, um, well, as of the time I'm filming this one video here. Something I noticed after picking these up is that the latest version of the Newtown Pro Line before they discontinued them all together the Proline 4 is basically a the um same thing as this the blades especially where the arm is is the same exact thing they're both made by air cool as the same bottom canopy the lower canopy same mounting hardware main difference is that the they don't have the holes being tapped right here for the swim blades and set it on the top. And it doesn't have a switch housing. And this one's the oldest one out of three. The other two are from the same date. This one's from 1999. The other ones are from like 2003, 2004. No, although they were all bought at the same time. Another thing that makes this one older is that it doesn't have the Monte Carlo logo in the switch housing. And the screws on this one, for some reason, are white. The blade screws. Whereas the other one, or the same thing with switch housing ones is, whereas the other two, they have them in brass. This one also came with the shortest down rod. The other two have longer down rods. So when I test all three of them, I will be stealing the down rod off of this one to show all three. And there is the tag right here. The air cool one. From June of 1999. December of 2001. But yeah, it's literally just the Pro Line. I mean, the Pro Line 4, now that I have seen these up close, it's literally the same thing as this, except the motor shape is just a tiny bit different. Where it's kind of like kind of grooves in a bit more around here, but it's almost the same exact motor and everything. Now that I look at it, but um, yeah, I always thought that these were pretty neat fans. It's a shame that they're not being made no more by or being sold by Monte Carlo. I think other companies sell them or sell a knockoff of it, but um, yeah.
and that'll be it for this video thanks for watching hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for more videos to come